Did you know that the future of sustainable livestock farming could lie in an unexpected cross? The Holstein and Brahmin breeds, two with opposing characteristics, combine to create animals that exceed expectations in productivity, resilience, and adaptability. This cross known as Brahmalando is revolutionizing farming practices by bringing together the best of both worlds. On one hand, the Holstein is globally recognized for its high milk production, while the Brahman stands out for its strength, hardiness, and ability to thrive in harsh climates. The combination of these traits results in hybrid cattle that adapt to a wide range of conditions and maximize performance in both meat and milk production systems. Advantages of the Holstein Brahmin cross, climate adaptability. Brahmin is a breed that excels in hot and humid climates due to its resistance to thermal stress, parasites, and tropical diseases. When crossed with Holstein, it produces a hybrid that retains much of this adaptive capacity, allowing farmers to succeed in regions where pure European breeds would not thrive. Additionally, these animals have thicker, pigmented skin, which protects them from sun damage. Improved Milk Productivity Although Brahman is not known for high milk production, its contribution to the cross improves reproductive efficiency and longevity in Holstein cows. The resulting hybrids usually maintain good milk production, though slightly lower than pure Holsteins, but compensate with greater disease resistance, lower mortality, and better energy balance. This is crucial in production systems where animal durability is as important as output. Quality meat and good carcass yield. The Holstein Brahmin cross is not only a solution for milk production, its mixed genetics also allow the males to be used for fattening systems. Thanks to the robust musculature and efficient growth inherited from the Brahmin, combined with the feed conversion efficiency of the Holstein, these animals are ideal for dual purpose systems, fertility and ease of management. Fertility and ease of calving are essential characteristics for any cattle breeding program. Hybrid females are often more fertile and face fewer reproductive issues than pure Holsteins, which reduces the costs associated with hormonal treatments and veterinary care. Furthermore, the docility of the Holstein combined with the manageable temperament of the Brahmin creates animals that are easier to handle, even in extensive systems. Economic implications, the Holstein Brahmin cross offers a cost-effective alternative for both small and large producers. These hybrids reduce the operational costs as they require fewer veterinary interventions and are more efficient in their use of feed resources. For example, in tropical regions where forage may be of lower quality, Brahman genetics help animals better utilize this resource, while Holstein genetics ensure adequate milk production. Moreover, this cross enables farmers to diversify their production. A single herd can generate income from milk, meat, and live animal sales, expanding business opportunities in local and international markets, sustainability, and resilience against climate change. In a world where climate change poses huge challenges for livestock farming, the Holstein Brahmin cross emerges as a viable solution. Its heat resistance and ability to survive in tough conditions make it an ally for sustainable production systems. Lower methane emissions per unit of product, better resource utilization, and reduced need for external inputs. Position this cross as an environmentally responsible option. Furthermore, its versatility helps reduce environmental pressure as it can adapt to various management systems from intensive to extensive and even grazing in marginal areas. Recommendations for implementing this cross, proper selection of breeding animals. It is essential to choose Holsteins with good dairy genetics and Brahmins with excellent hardiness. This balance ensures that the hybrids inherit the best traits from both breeds. Strategic genetic management. The first generation F1 usually shows the best hybrid vigor. In subsequent generations, it is recommended to carefully assess results to avoid losing desirable traits. Adapted management systems. Holstein Brahmin hybrids require appropriate management that takes advantage of their strengths. Mixed grazing and supplementation systems have proven highly effective, especially in tropical and subtropical climates. Ongoing training. Farmers adopting this cross should be trained in nutrition, health, and genetic management to maximize their animal's potential. Partnerships with research institutions can be key to improving outcomes, success stories, and future prospects. 
In countries like Brazil, Mexico, and India, the Holstein Brahmin Cross has proven to be a transformative strategy in the livestock sector. These countries, with predominantly hot climates and challenging conditions for pure European breeds, have found this hybrid to be an efficient solution to overcome production barriers. For example, Hybrid cows have shown remarkable performance in semi-intensive systems. Their ability to produce high-quality milk even in high humidity and extreme heat environments has made them a preferred option for farmers seeking to maximize their performance in challenging conditions. Additionally, their natural resistance to tropical diseases significantly reduces the costs associated with veterinary treatments. On the other hand, Holstein Brahmin males have gained popularity in the meat market due to their excellent feed conversion and ability to develop strong musculature, traits inherited from the Brahmin. In fattening systems, these animals reach market weights in less time and with a less demanding diet, resulting in high-quality meat and economic value. This makes them especially attractive for dual-purpose systems, where both milk and meat production are maximized. Research in cattle genetics continues to drive the potential of this cross. Academic institutions and private companies are using advanced technologies such as artificial insemination and genomic selection to refine breeding lines. These advancements allow producers to identify animals with specific traits such as greater heat tolerance or better milk production on low quality forage. In countries like Mexico, pilot projects on small and medium-sized farms have already reported significant increases in productivity and reduced operational costs thanks to the use of these hybrids. Moreover, government and private initiatives have started promoting the Holstein Brahmin Cross as a key tool for strengthening food security in vulnerable regions. Hybrid animals not only generate higher yields, but they also adapt to sustainable systems that minimize environmental impact. In India, for example, farmers are integrating this cross into regenerative farming systems where animals feed on agricultural waste, contributing to natural soil fertilization. The success of this cross is not only measured in terms of productivity, but also in its ability to transform the lives of rural communities. In many regions, small farmers have found the Holstein Brahmin Cross to be an opportunity to compete in wider markets thanks to improved product quality and cost reduction. Looking ahead, the Holstein Brahmin Cross represents the future of resilient, adaptable, and highly productive livestock farming with ongoing advancements in genetic research, breeding technologies, and improved management practices. This hybrid has the potential to expand to regions with extreme climates, including areas with high temperatures, humidity, or limited forage. As climate change continues to impact agriculture, breeds like the Holstein Brahmin Cross offer a practical solution to sustain production levels while reducing environmental impact. By combining the high milk yield and efficient feed conversion of the Holstein with the heat tolerance and disease resistance of the Brahmin, this hybrid breed is equipped to thrive in diverse environments. Ultimately, its ability to integrate the best traits of two very different breeds positions it as a groundbreaking solution, helping meet the growing demand for food while overcoming the challenges facing modern livestock farming, ensuring both productivity and sustainability.